right. So I had a moment to check out what it is that I was supposed to, I guess, get. And I'm sort of missing like how I was supposed to know it. Um, it's a little frustrating, actually. So that's okay. Welcome to episode three of Let's Play 3D.Game Heroes. And we're picking up where we left off. Did I say three? I meant to say 13. And if I said 13, I still meant to say 13. Okay. So what is it is, is it turns out that despite the fact that my map is marked to come here, uh, in fact, the sage is in the inn. So you know what? I am going to go ahead and I'm going to use one of my wings because that that's just agitating. Um, hopefully, you know, hopefully there's some kind of fast travel item eventually in the game that'll let me kind of do this without having to consume it all the time. And I mean, it's fine if there isn't. You know, um, using these like homeward bones, basically. All right, so he's apparently inside the inn. How was I supposed to know that? I don't even know. Maybe, maybe the music was supposed to be like a hint. So hey, oh, the secret haunt. No, nope, nope, nope. Is this him here? All right, and they all look so much the same, right? I hate to say that, but they really do. <sighs> Are you the one who brought back the desert's treasure? Yes, yes, master. Akadu found the orb. Ah, that is indeed the orange orb. Then you beat the stone golem? Yeah, eventually. Naturally, Master Akato is a hero who can repel any monster. Ho ho ho, you have quite a sidekick hero. Fairies aren't usually so trusting, so you must be ex truly extraordinary. I've been waiting for someone like you. You mean you're the sage? Ho ho ho, that's right, I am Octane. Hi Octane. And you have done well, Master Akadu. I shall grant you the power of the orange orb, hero. Hey, hey, it's another one of those uh, coins. What does this do? Got a shader magic normal map. That spell can create shockwaves to strike ground foes. Master Akadu, I don't get it. It's called normal map. Well, yeah, these are all like graphics uh, terminology references, like pixel shader and, uh, uh, you know, a normal map. Normal maps are cool. They're like bump maps. And what are bump maps? Uh, bump maps were basically like these grayscale images that you could uh, apply uh, alongside of a texture over like, you know, some geometry, um, like, you know, meshes or whatever. And when those bump maps were applied, they would actually affect the way that light would interact with it. So it could create a false sense of depth. Um, and that's how you actually basically added like fake geometry over real geometry to make objects look truly 3D. Now, if you look at a uh, bump map from the right angle, it's gonna it's gonna kind of show because it's still kind of flat or it's literally flat. Um, and so they came up with um, they came up with normal maps. Now, I want to say that uh, traditional traditional uh, bump maps uh, only could go values zero through 255, right? So what is that? That is uh, two to the um, Let's see here, 10, 24, uh, what, what, one, one, two, four, eight, that's, and then 16, 32, 64, 128, and then 128 to 256. So, anyway, it's, it's what, that's two to the ninth power? Um, which I, you know, that doesn't make sense to me now that I think about it. I must have skipped a number, but that's okay. Um, but those were the values of which you could actually uh, have bump maps. So they weren't as diverse. So they went ahead and they did something where you could do basically what is like 65,300 and uh, whatever, right? I, I don't, you know, I always forget that number. Uh, but I think that's then two to the 16th power. But you could actually have the full RGB range uh, to represent depth. And so normal maps then would actually make it like look even more kind of scaled. Still kind of flat, but it's a better technique. And then of course you have uh, like spectral, uh, and I don't I don't think they're called spectral maps. But anyway, getting back to this. All right. Uh, but it makes shockwaves. Can't these spells be consistent? Huh. Sage Octane, we'll head for the next temple. Have you been to Lake Garland? There lies the Aqua Temple. It's south of the castle. Le South? Thank you. You know what to do, Master Arkadu. I do. I begrudgingly head to the Water Temple. Because I have a feeling like the Water Temple is going to be supremely frustrating too. And really, uh... Alright, so what is this? In fact, yep. 
right? That's probably a normal map. You see that it's flat and it just displaces the uh, it just displaces the light. It creates a little wave. Now I don't know what it does though. Um, so that's really interesting. Maybe we'll find out. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna consume our last wing. And hopefully I don't live to regret this. Because I think I will. I'm gonna be like, oh man, I really wanted to go somewhere and Alright, so that's that's where that is. Well, you know what? Alright, so let's go there because I think we wanted to get um, some dancer, right, from Colnaria? Or was that Rayjack? Well, luckily they're neighbors. So, let's see here. I wish there was an easy... No, it was the uh, martial artist chick. I think she was from Cor Corneria. Haha, <laughs> Corneria. Like Star Fox, right? No. Colnaria. Monsters are scary. Can't go outside. I'll let you play. Yep. Nope. Come back later. All right, so we get to play maybe a video game at some point. Need a room? Nope. Please come again. Welcome to my store. Take your time. What does he have? Oh, yes! Elixir. Restores everything. Honestly, I don't need the elixir. Sleeping bags, magical bags, candles, lamps, wonder dust. Uh, yeah, wonder dust. Oh, oh, I can buy the wind wings. There's like a value pack. Uh, all right, so 220. That's a good deal, right? Five wind wings, yes. Because you know what? That'll enable us to get around faster. Yes, I absolutely want to shop more. And then I want to get... The Wonder Dust is kind of cool, I guess. But I'd rather have something that I can count on, which is going to be opening up my menu and getting this... All right, very cool. Nope, don't need to continue shopping. So finally, we actually have something that'll allow us to come back when we die. Or no, no, I'm a liar. We have something, though, that'll actually allow us to heal in a dungeon, which has been like a huge problem. So let's go in here. Now this town's pretty small. We can go through all of Culinaria pretty quickly. All right, how's it going? Our town is running out of food at this rate. Mommy, I'm hungry. Oh man, you know, maybe I can bring them some food or do something, right? Be the hero. Um, you know, and at some point too, I need to go ahead and upgrade my new cool sword. I mean, it's super cool on its own. Yeah, okay, a spa. I mean, how am I going to bring her a whole spa? I don't even understand. Okay. All right, so there's just that one area, I guess, left in this town, and then we'll go north to, uh, like, Dotnia. Oh, wait, no, we're all in Dotnia. Wait. Uh, how do I... Oh, yeah. No, I'm just thinking about this wrong... Wait, what? Oh, okay, no, no, no. I want to go this way. Talk to him. Oh, don't kill him. Uh-huh. Okay. I mean, not inanity, but, uh, you know, I don't need to... I don't need to know that. That's not helping me. It's not doing anything. Oh, hey, maybe you are. Maybe you guys can take out the monsters in the Aqua Temple, eh? Yes, maybe we can. Okay, so we talked to her about the Aqua Temple, and I actually thought she might have been, like, the trigger that made it, like, the right place to go at that point in time, but it wasn't. It was not the thing that we needed. Okay, that's all right. We're gonna go to Ray Jack. And really, you know, every village trip, regardless of like how much it feels like I'm kind of derailing what I'm supposed to be doing, is actually pretty beneficial. Oh yeah, I forget about the rabbits. And you know, maybe we'll come across some poles or something that you know we didn't. Uh, we didn't use or, or something like that. There's, of course, that beginning area. I kind of like it, though. Um, it does capture the, the feeling of exploration that the old Zelda games have. Or had. No, have. Yeah, have present. I really wish, you know, uh, so I'm actually avoiding doing any Nintendo property because it turns out that Nintendo... As, as a publisher, or no, as a developer, uh, maybe as both, really. They don't like people doing Let's Play, so that's unfortunate. <sighs> yeah, they, I mean, I consider it uh, a derivative work. I think that's sort of the proper way to look at it. I feel like this is, you know, the commentary is very much a part of the experience, and so it's a pretty heavy modification. Another letter, yes! Gee, that guy is too persistent, it's creepy. Please, just keep the dingy thing. 
But I do have a favor to ask. I've got someone in is interested in I'm interested in. Can you deliver a letter to him? I'm counting on you. Alright, where's the guy? Got a blue letter. He's a friend of Deke the inventor. He should be here in Rayjack Village. Cool. So like a fetch quest, but not like a terrible fetch quest, I hope. Or maybe it just continues to turn into like more of a fetch quest. Red, apple green, apple blue, stick a candle, candle lamp. I don't need any of these. Blue potion's kind of cool, I guess, but, uh, and I'm like, what, I'm like three, three rupees, wait, rupees, or uh, three Gs away, right, you know, oh, Gita not a rupee, I don't know how many, I just, just want to, okay, so, I make, ah, you make bats, I know that, I know you'll make me a nice bat, I don't need a nice bat, I do need to know what the bestiary does, though. A real spa egg. Okay, so there's someone else talking about spas. Want to see some magic? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Meow, yes. It's Percival. Yes, okay. Um, that's right. So let's see. What does this do? A rare book of monsterology. Okay. But... I don't remember where Deke the Inventor is. Satori note. Swords, yep, yep, yep. Maximum potential. You know, maybe, maybe it's worth it to, no. Beam. The sword beam? Yeah, let's see, what does that do? That would be cool. I've never extended my sword beam before. Oh, that's right. I don't... Ah, I'm just three away. Each Nissan, right? Huh. Okay, let's go. We checked out those places. Or no, we didn't check out this place. Is it like a weapon store then? Does, that, does this game actually have vendors that sell weapons? Maybe. No. No, no, no. Nope, no swords, just arrows. All right. Interested in playing Dash Circuit? Yeah, sure. Good luck. Okay. All right, I don't know what Dash Circuit is, but we're about to find out. Mm. I just like that annoying race and, um, all right. View the tutorial? No. We're just gonna do it. Hit set. Go. Well, this is a good way to get practice with the dash. All right, maybe I can get better. Hopefully. Presumably, presumably I can get better. All right, let's try and do this tight. Ah, okay. Uh, so is this just like infinite? Can I just keep doing this? Goal, okay. Best, no record. Congratulations, a new record. Try again, yes. I think we can do this. I think we can get comfortable with how this works. I actually hope there's like a prize or something. That would be really cool. 43 seconds, so I didn't even spend a minute doing this. Oh, look at that. We're already off to a better start. Nah, kind of. I'm trying to do it flawlessly, but man, it's really, it's really tough. I know, I know, I, right? Like, oh, geez, Carl, why are you just doing all this? Final lap. I bet you there's some kind of a trophy for doing it perfectly. I mean, you know, like it's perfect as like not hitting the walls. Goal! All right, yep, I beat my time. New record, try again. I bet you there's like 30 seconds, right? 30 seconds seems like it's probably the magical number for this. 
And I think I can come close. Alright, come on. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Focus, focus. Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Focus, focus, focus. Focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Ah! Foc fo fo ha ha ha, focus. All right, was that like 32 seconds, maybe? What was the time? 30.29. A new record, I understand. I think I can do 30 seconds. I'm almost positive. So let's do this one more time. Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah, no. Focus, 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 focus. No, focus, focus. Focus. Focus, 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 all right, get set. Focus. Turn, 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 turn. No, get in the game. Turn, 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 turn. Oh, you speed up when you do it more often. Turn, turn, turn. Dang it! I'm actually not gonna get a better time. I'm actually getting worse at this, if, if that's possible. Well, clearly it's possible because I'm doing it. Yep, that was like 35 or 36 seconds here. Ridiculous. Okay, all right, no. I'm just, I'm just on the border being able to do it. That's what's so irritating. I mean, like... Almost. No. All right, was that 30 seconds? Under 30? Okay. I'm at least happy with that. Yes! Got a prize for finishing in 30 seconds. Got 100 G. Oh, really? That's it? No, I don't want to try again. Your ridiculous door prize is ridiculous. Oh, but you know what? Not that ridiculous. Hmm. All right. It's not super ridiculous because what we can do now is we can buy another health bottle. Well, so we can go into the water temple. Actually, we could buy an elixir maybe. No, that's 350. Whoops. All right, what's up with you? Uh-oh. I'm getting married next month. This is bad. I can't accept like a letter like this. I apologize. Can you just throw it away for me, baby? Hmm, and while you're here, can I ask- Ah, no, it is! There's like, the great material continuum. Ah! Can you take this letter to my fiance? Where does she live? Is it, what color is it now? Yellow letter. She lives here in Ray Jack. She doesn't get out much because of the, aha. All right, so we know where she is. Cool. Now, do we want to talk to the inventor for any reason? Yes, they are wonderful. Good, good. I'm glad I made those. Okay. Try them with a sword that has good penetration. I feel like he's trying to give me, like, I don't know, like, real-life advice or something. I mean, obviously not. 
All right, what's up with you? Spa egg. And some creepy twins here. Magic mirror, poison bog, something. Yes, here we go. Here's the dancer. I do know someone who would. Someone in Ortego mentioned needing a good dancer? That's great. Let's head over to Ortego Village. I'll earn my keep, just like old times. Sounds like sounds like we'll be on our way, hero. <laughs> Thank you very much. I hope your journey is, a pros is as prosperous as ours. All right, cool. So I got to do some good in the world. I like this. This is something that uh, brings me personal fulfillment. Except maybe not in a video game. That's okay, though, right? There's some fun to be had, right? And so there's, you know, fun has a point. Fun is fun. Punch. Okay, so. I want to be like the hero who defeats the dark thing. He's very agile, though. Try to corner it. Oh, yeah, he's talking about the monster thing. So, wait, I was thinking that the monster was the one who told me about the monsters, but apparently not. Apparently, uh... I'm Lucy. Okay. So we got a dog that wants to be human. We got a slime that wants to be human. Maybe there's a way to make them human. Nope. Okay. Well, I was I was wondering. I was wondering if that might do something. I'm just just a horrible, horrible person here. Okay. Well, you know what I want to do then? I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go back to Ortego real fast. I think because we're gonna do the Water Temple very soon, and I'm really liking the idea of having a lot of cool stuff, or at least you know, so my character can be like awesome and to his full potential. And we can kind of run. And I used to love to do this actually with the boots. Ah, okay. The fact that you can change directions, though, that's nice. No, no, no. So, there might be a, a, a maybe a, some kind of a... Like, there might be tiers of, like, that treasure then, too. So, for instance, with that, uh, that block racing game, I can't think of the name of it now. I just did it. That's okay. But there might be some kind of an advantage. Hey, what's this way? What's in here? Did we go in here? I feel like if we went in here, it was like early on in the game and... Question mark, what's up? No, I, I actually don't care. Yeah, it's my money, you're darn right. You can't have my rupees. Or uh, gold or, or whatever, you know, whatever this game calls them. You can't have them. I've spent a large amount of time investing my own time into acquiring them. Oh, there we go. There's there's a desert again. There we go. Now we got the full-size Sword of Doom. Oh, and the cool part is, is actually, once we go through the next dungeon, we'll have, like... No, really? Really? Yeah. Thank you. Uh, how far are we from Rayjack, actually? Or not Rayjack, Ortego. We're, you know, we're a reasonable distance, actually. I feel like we could... We could do that without having to use one of the Wind Wings. Although I bought a bunch, so we didn't actually have to go through a lot of frustration. Pop, pop, pop. Pop, pop, video. <laughs> Everybody, which way we going? Yeah. All right. So that I'm gonna cheat. Yep. Using the item. And back to Ortego. I want to say there was something we wanted to buy here. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm nope. Don't care about the. Uh huh. We never did find the martial arts girl, though. All right, I do have spare. You're a great hero. Come back later. I'll have your money. All right, so that's an investment in, like, helping somebody. I'm kind of hoping that'll be okay. Pay it forward. Okay. Cool. 
Oh, those are the dancers. Yeah, um, I wonder if we get something out of that. Oh, I didn't take the thing to, uh... I didn't take the thing to, uh, the, the wife. <sighs> That's all right. I meant to. Want to play Blockout? Sure. What's Blockout? Good luck. Finally, we get to see this mini game we've been teased about, actually, for quite some time. Blockout. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. I want to go into it blind. Is this like Breakout? I'm almost positive at this point. So left, right, and uh, hit the ball. Yes, it is exactly as I think it is. Wait. I am terrible at this. Okay. Now, can I just touch it? Nope. Guard miss. All right. Oh man, I've got a bandage over. All right, so yeah, I got a bandage on my pointer finger. So it's actually making doing it this way very difficult. That's actually why I'm kind of having a hard time with this. This is cool though. And Breakout's, Breakout's an amazing game, right? That's been around since she's the Atari 2600. Oh, oh yeah, Apple. Oh gosh, how am I supposed to handle it? I can't handle all these balls. Nice, stage one cleared. Stage two, start. Whoa, ah, okay, so the yellow ones take two hits. Ah, I like that it's actually literally the number two. So what we, what, what our aim really should be is to get in the center area and then let it knock around. I would love another multi-ball. That's what makes games like this, you know, such a blast. And I, I hate to say, oh no! Oh, game over. <sighs> All right, we're gonna try one more time. Stage one, start, okay. So we got this. So if I want to move faster, I can release the shield. So that's good to know. Okay. No, there was this, uh, you know, I, I used to have a Toshiba satellite um, laptop uh, like a long time ago. I mean, we're talking like 2006, 2005 even, I think. I was, no! How is that a guard miss? Anyway, um, it had this, this horrible, horrible thing called Wild Tangent, um, which sure was like some kind of video game playing utility thing, maybe, except really it was just full of spyware and... A mess, if I remember correctly. All right. You know, uh, I'm actually not... Well, I'm not... No! All right, I only have one left. Please. Nah, really? This is going to be, like, horrible. Anyway, so Wild Tangent, though, there was this uh, breakout game, and, like, it was really cool because you had all these cool powers and... And, um... There is absolutely no conservation of momentum mechanism in the physics of this game, is there? Okay, whatever. So, that's all right. We don't play by the laws of thermodynamics. It's just fine. Is that thermodynamics? I don't even know. Maybe I shouldn't talk about things I don't know about. I should only talk about things I do know about. But I can still wonder about things I don't really know about. Maybe just not publicly, right? You know, like, oh man, I can't believe you don't know about thermodynamics. What the heck is wrong with you? Well, I'm sorry. Oops. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe that'll be one of my goals uh, when I have a bunch of extra time when I'm not recording videos. And uh, I'll learn about it and then I'll teach other people about it. Then I'll probably actually have a lot of things wrong. So maybe, maybe something that's heavy like that, I should not necessarily try to teach people if I don't really know what I'm talking about. I'm doing a lot of thinking out loud. All right, cool. I got the green apple. We're doing better. I don't know if we're on our, I can't remember if we're on our third ball. And I bet you that the, uh, the threshold for earning something out of this game is, is a little bit higher than uh, some of the other games. Like maybe it's like stage five or something and you get something. Oh, wow. So it looks like if you take out Really? You, you're gonna miss that treasure chest? This thing's right, right there. All right, so left, right, and I just need to be 
No! Okay, whatever. All right. I still have some balls left. Send it. Okay, does it start off at like a random angle? Stupid random seed. Pseudo random, I'll turn my system on. Ha, ah, that's cool. But I, I think, oh dear. Yeah, I'll, I'll turn my game system on like at a very specific second and start this at a very specific second. And then, maybe then, it will actually start straight. But that's, that, you know, who wants to figure that out, right? I don't want to figure that out. That does not sound like fun. Oh my gosh. Yeah, whatever, no, we're done, we're done. It's okay, nope, not trying again. Not frustrated, but I don't want to spend a ton of time um, doing this on these videos. So let's go check out the dancers. That's cool. Maybe we'll get an item out of that. Uh, what's up with you? Oh, it's you. Thanks for bringing her here and breathing life back into this village. Take this, you've earned it. What is it? Heart piece, maybe? I want a heart piece. Life shard, yes. And I got a fourth life shard, life up. It's nice to see the village so lively again. Hello, hero. Thank you for setting up this dancer gig. Please allow me to dance for you. So stimulating. Okay. Our income is so stable, I don't have to worry about bills anymore. It must be nice. In fact, I think I have too much free time. May I go shopping? Maybe I should go shopping with the money she's earned. Okay. Uh, you could. Um. All right, so. Vents are so adorable. She's so great. She's so pretty. I love you, Mary. Whoops. Doc, come on. Have you seen the cute dancer? Yes, I have. I have totally seen the cute dancer. Okay. So, I'm about done here. I am, I am done here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take the wing. And I'm going to go back to uh, Ray Jack. And then from Ray Jack, I'm then going to go... Well, actually, no. I'm going to end at Ray Jack. And I can't remember. It was one of the houses where, like... There was like the guy and the girl. No, it's not a guy and a girl. It's like two people. And they're... Okay, that's news to me. All he did has have dinner once. He's got the wrong idea. You can do whatever you want with that letter, but give me a new one. What color is this gonna be? Hey, can you give this letter to the gatekeeper at the castle? Actually, I totally can. That's not even that far. Got a green letter. I'm such a huge fan. He stands on the gate's left side. Thank you. We can totally do that, right? That's not even far. We're practically neighbors. We can just, you know, we can do this number. I haven't been to the castle in a while. Well, no, that's not true. I totally went to the castle recently. But, I mean, like, you know, it doesn't feel like it's been recent. In fact, it feels like I've spent a lot longer on this game doing a lot of inanity than I would like. Now, there were, didn't feel like there was a lot of inanity. Mm -hmm. Ha, that's funny. Okay. Hey, is this that reply? Ha, oh, thank you, my love finally reached her. You can have this in return. The end of the fetch quest, is it a heart piece? Yeah, okay, well that's cool. I feel like putting on a tux and silk hat. I'll schedule our first date ASAP. Hmm, what does she mean she was always a fan? Ha 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 ha, right? You were watching her far, so she. His eyes on me all over again. Okay, so cool. Uh, this is a great spot to end the game. In fact, here we go. Here's our starting position. So, what do I want you to do? I want you to subscribe and I want you to do the thing. What's the thing? The thing is interact with me, right? Make some comments. Talk to me. Give me suggestions. Uh, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Tell me what I'm doing right. Uh, go ahead and uh, face me on the like book. And you know what? I'm really enjoying this. So I hope to see you for the next episode. I'm about to go ahead and record that right now. Thanks for watching, and um, I'll see you next time.